Welcome back. A good day loves local and there's nothing more local than pierogi, piva and polka. Did You're, I pronounce it? You correctly? did. Do you remember what I told you it meant? Oh, beer. Yes. Right. Is you that got here? it. Yeah, it's coming. No, we don't have the beer. <laughs> but we've got some of the good stuff. The Polish influence is strong in the Toledo area. Joe Zaleski and Debbie Rakowski from the Toledo Area Polka Society has your invitation to the annual Polish summer picnic. And you brought some plot check this morning. We did. Polish coffee cake. Okay. Remember Chef Ella taught us how to yes, make it that I did. time? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A lot goes into making that. <laughs> Many couple hours of hard work. work. Yeah, a yeah, yes. couple days worth of hard work. Yeah, and so that's why everybody's been gearing up for this, right? Everybody's been getting ready, preparing all the food, getting everybody ready for the picnic. Yes, absolutely. Yes. Yeah, we've got a great event. This is our eighth annual. Nice. Um, started actually nine years ago, but we missed one year with the uh, pandemic. Yeah, everybody, course, there's always an asterisk mm -hmm. here. Yes, yeah. yes, <laughs> absolutely. So, yeah, we're excited. We've got a uh, lot of uh, musical entertainment, continuous music from the time the gate open until they close on both days. Um, some bands from uh, Buffalo, Canada, John Gura and Gorales from the Toronto, Canada area. A, a group named Seven from Buffalo. They'll be on Friday night. We've got some local representation with the Polish American Concert Band on Friday. Also had Dwayne Malinowski's Polka Jamboree on Saturday and Dinah Brass on Saturday and Concertina All-Stars. So that's some big uh, names. So, yes. so yeah. a lot happening. So yeah. why is this so important to uh, highlight Polish culture and let uh, people hear the music and eat some of the food? We have a lot of Polish influence in Toledo, Ohio. The history is very strong from the neighborhoods uh, years back and it's just a great opportunity for people to come out celebrate their heritage enjoy some food some yep. family mm -hmm. it's really about just gathering as a family mm -hmm. you know I think and the Polish picnic is I mean, anywhere you go in this country, for people who have immigrated, will say, "Oh yeah, the Polish picnic." And we had one in the the church sponsored, and where I grew up in northeastern Pennsylvania. But it was always called the the summer, the Polish picnic. You gotta yep. have the picnic. Mm -hmm. So I mean, this is something that is you know goes back to Poland. I mean, it does absolutely. That's where the tradition started, and that's what we, as an organization, are you know in the business of promoting the Polish American. Polka music specifically, but also the you know the Polish heritage locally. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and you know sometimes um, with uh, our generation, the older generation, the heritage is there, it's intact, it's locked. But the younger generation sometimes it skips them a bit. Are you guys working on helping those young people uh, thrive and understand uh, this Polish heritage? We are. Yeah, we're we're doing all that we can to uh, you know to encourage the younger generations to participate in the activity. Activities, whether it's volunteering or mm -hmm. getting involved in the music or you know making the potsek mm -hmm. and, and things like that but uh, yeah you're right I mean it has definitely changed over the years um, as the communities have kind of spread out and you know what have you that um, you know there's um, there's kind of like a gap there that mm -hmm. uh, you know we we all all ethnic backgrounds need to continue to embrace our you know heritage and uh, those traditions are important mm -hmm. what well, makes us uh, who we are and unique it is. Uh, so we've got Polish coffee cake which I'm so good uh, she brought the <laughs> stick of butter too, you know, because a, full, a full stick of butter everything's yes. better with butter it, it is right um, but of course we're gonna have the savory stuff too um, you know the pierogi and we have stuffed cabbage stuff like yes. that yeah yes. what are Absolutely. you talking about guamki so, mm -hmm. kibasa mm -hmm. yep. oh yeah we have a uh, pierogi eating contest oh, on boy. Saturday that you can <laughs> we'll sign you up out. before we leave. <laughs> yeah, I, was, I was thinking maybe next year we need to do like a celebrity pierogi eating contest. Yes, yes I'm in. I have, yes. I have your winner down. right here. <laughs> if she doesn't win, I know she's going to be there. And yeah. whatever, whatever stuffing you got. I'll take the sauerkraut, the cheese, whatever, the yeah. potato, whatever you got. There you go. and, and with the Polish coffee cake, if my memory serves me well, there's a lot that could potentially go wrong with this, right? So you have to really work on this. So again, you said this takes hours to prepare. Yes. But yes. this will be plentiful, right? Oh, yes. Yeah. Oh, yes. <laughs> yeah, basically two days of, uh, you know, two 12-hour days to bake about 200 of the pot sec. Yes. <laughs> wow. Yes. Yeah. That's, I mean, and there's so much love that goes into it, though. Absolutely. There is. It's a you labor know, of love, for sure. There really, I mean, you have to with all that work. But, it, you know, and it just makes it taste all that much better, doesn't yes. it? Yes. Yeah? Yes. Made with love. Oh, made with love. So this is happening, is it tomorrow and Saturday? Yes. Friday, Friday and Saturday. And Saturday. At we, Oche Grove, right? Yes. Yep. 
Yeah, we're uh, basically 5 o'clock through 11 o'clock on Friday and then noon till 11 on Saturday. Um, a lot of the local vendors, uh, you know, Stanley's will be there, Ed Basinski will be there, we've got uh, Bee's Pierogies, um, uh, Carolyn's Catering will do a Polish-style chicken dinner on uh, Saturday. We've got a dance uh, show from the Echoes of Poland. They'll Wonderful. be there out uh, Saturday afternoon, 5.30 or so. But yeah, just fun for the whole family. And uh, you know, we want to fill the Grove and have a good time and <laughs> celebrate our you know, Polish heritage. It's going to be beautiful this weekend. Too. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Great weather. The weather is That's an awesome great. spot. Yeah, absolutely. Yes. I'm hungry. Dig in, Amanda. <laughs> She's been, been staring she's at it. been staring at it this entire time. It's like, go ahead and eat. We expect yes. this already. And see, the nod. So good. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Takes you back to childhood a little bit. A little bit. Yeah. Oh, so good. That's yes. good. Thank you for feeding me. There will be You're plenty. Welcome. There will be plenty. Feel free to eat the rest. Yeah. <laughs> I'll share. Share some with share. Mike, Maggie. I think they would appreciate it. I'll share it with the bit. newsroom. Yes. Yeah. Oh, they don't there need you it. go. They don't yeah. need it. <laughs> Take it home. Folks, thanks so much for coming today.